Hey Fort McMurray, it's your boy Jeff down here at Legacy Dodge on another How To Tuesday, teaching you everything that you need to know about your new or used vehicle. And today, I wanna to talk a little bit about tire pressure. Now, tire pressure is extremely important to the safety of you and your family. If you do not have the proper tire pressure in your tires, you're not gonna have the proper grip, thus keeping your vehicle on the road safely. Additionally, if your tires are inflated too much, you're gonna wear out that center strip of the tire way too quickly, and if they don't have enough air in them, you're gonna wear out the sides of them and the tire's gonna get cupped very quickly. So I'm gonna teach you exactly how to know what tire pressure your vehicle should have. On every modern vehicle, your recommended tire pressure should be listed on a label just inside the door sill. All right, now the label of this 2024 Jeep Grand Cherokee says the recommended tire pressure should be 36 PSI. Now I can use the digital readout in the driver cluster. A few presses down on the left keypad and a few presses right will get me over to the tire pressure gauge. It shows all four tires on this are 35, just one off of the recommended tire pressure. Now is that the right tire pressure? Yup, looks like we're ready for a road trip. Now, if you're asking yourself, Jeff, I don't have a brand new 2024 Jeep Grand Cherokee. I don't have a digital readout in my driver cluster. Well, we have up here at Legacy, a good old fashioned analog tire pressure gauge. We give them out for free, so you can come by anytime and we'll hook you up. Simply take the valve cover off, insert the reader, and there we go, exactly 36 PSI. So that's a little bit about tire pressure on a How To Tuesday. As always, my name's Jeff, I'm here to help. You can call or text me at 416-523-6585 with any questions you have. I got your back for life.